Hi everyone, welcome back to Simply Maha and today we're going to be making viral TikTok coffee even better by turning it into this glorious, scrumptious, delicious mm, ice cream. I added chocolate, I added walnuts, kind of resemble, you know, almond mocha fudge, but better. So let's get started. Right, starting off with the base of my no churn ice cream just whipping up a cup of heavy cream and of course you can do this in the hand mixer or standing mixer but i'm gonna do it by hand because i'm gonna stand with all of you people who told me you didn't have a mixer last time i made ice cream i'm with you sis let's go it's gonna become in three stages and this will be the last after about 10 minutes of you panting and huffing and puffing there you have it okay you know it's done when you tilt the bowl and nothing comes out and just a tip for you guys if you're whisking at the end just you know go down all the sides with the two fingers and it's all gonna collect at the bottom and then tap it to the bowl and then all the heavy cream will release so step one whipping up one cup of heavy cream step two getting the foamy goodness ready one tablespoon each of sugar coffee instant coffee and hot water this is the instant coffee i use and this is five steps i know i know this is step number one where you're just mixing okay step number two it gets just a little bit darker i mean lighter <laughs> there you have it oh my god can you tell i ate this like five minutes ago i'm still so jittery this is step four and now this is your final whipped virgin you don't want it to be super whipped like whipped cream you still want it to you know fall down in ribbon like motions and then you're gonna melt a fourth of a cup of chocolate and now we assemble add a 14 ounce can of sweetened condensed milk to your heavy cream yes get all that in there tip i put a little bit of that to my milk when i actually make the coffee itself makes it taste so much better so we're just gonna mix that in and then transfer it to a tight lid container because you do not want any air in this that's gonna form ice crystals so I'm just gonna transfer it to this big Tupperware I'm gonna put a little bit of walnuts in there you can use almonds I had walnuts so then I'm gonna put in the chocolate that I melted and what I like is when this freezes the chocolate will freeze at a different texture than the ice cream so you're gonna get a lot of you know different textures you're gonna get a little bit of crunch and then now we're gonna drizzle the coffee foam and let me tell you this is so annoying to work with it's just so sticky so you want to work with it really fast and then just wash the bowl immediately and now we just swirl make any patterns you want don't be fussy about it you don't want to make this all the way through because when you want to go and serve it you still want to see a little bit of the white you still want to see the chocolate and everything freeze it the night later i wake up and look look and i am pretty sure it was my brother but look at how smooth that is very very nice now i am piling this high and tall and proud for my instagram picture but this is super super rich okay so you only want to have just you know like a scoop because this is super rich okay just keep that in mind and also look at how smooth that is turned out great absolutely loved it and i hope you will too you better be making this and you better send me your remakes and i will see you next time here on simply maha bye bye